What is going on guys? Welcome back from our UFC Undisputed 3. Uh, we just got, got done doing career mode, let's go into title mode. I think after you've done title mode, you can do title defense mode. Alright, let's go through title mode I believe. Uh, you can play on experience or... Let's play on experience again. And let's use... Who should I use? Uh, let's go light heavyweight. What was it? What was the other option on the bomb? I didn't check it out. Oh, okay. All right, here we go. This is my favorite guy here, Mauricio Shogun. I've been using this guy a lot online. I like him for his Muay Thai. Not sure how many fights I have to uh, go through in order to win the belt. But after we've done this, I most likely will be doing a tile defense mode on top of that. Between Vladimir, the janitor Matyushenko, and the dangerous Brazilian, Mauricio Shogun Hua. Our tale of the tape is brought to you by the only motorcycles worthy of being in the octagon, Harley Davidson. Okay, fighters, are you ready? Mauricio you ready? Shogun Hua, Vladimir Matyushenko, and here we Let's go. Fight. Joe, how do you see this playing out for Mauricio Shogun Hua? He's certainly All right, here we go, man. The light heavyweight division. The question, Joe, Mauricio do you Shogun Hua. looking at the next champion? Absolutely, Mike. He has the talent and the will already. Now, all he has... Oh, that one dropped Oh, my him. God. Oh, my God. I've had to knock him out already. Shogun's a beast. He got blasted, but got it looks like he right, man. back pretty quickly. Look, his oh, head's already red. Kick. Are you kidding me? Huge. Oh, he's tagged yep, again. you done. Let me grab him. Situation. Bam. Oh, he's hurt badly. He's hurt he's bad, down. man. Get up. Get your ass up. Oh, he recovers. This crowd is going nuts. Quick hands. Oh, nice left and All right. right. Let's try this. And this Sometimes again. Sometimes shorter, Whoa. quicker punches are the way to go. Oh, head kick. All right, here we go. To the chin. Good night. Mauricio Shogun Hua. That was a very quick battle right there. Let's see it again. Man, he got some torque in those hips, didn't he, Joe? Yeah. Damn. Just perfect technique, right in the perfect spot. I think they purposely did again. that for like um, incredible the first few fights. Where um, they get knocked out really easy. And I think the, the more fights you go Here's through, the harder it gets. Ladies and gentlemen, it feels like he had no health Kevin there. Mohal has called a stop to this contest at one minute. 46 seconds. He definitely had nothing. I kicked him a few times round. and his head went red immediately. And the victory goes to Mauricio Shogun Hua. All right. Wow, 97% after a few head kicks. UFC Fight Night Live! Coming up next, a light heavyweight showdown between the Huntington Beach bad boy, Tito Ortiz, and the dangerous Brazilian, Mauricio Shogun Hua. Tale of the Tick is brought to you by Dodge. Are you ready? Are you ready? Mauricio Shogun Hua. Tito, Tito Ortiz. Ortiz. All right, here we go. Tito's big underway. head. Joe, how do you see this playing out for Mauricio Ah, Shogun take him Hua. down. He's coming off a big win in his last appearance. Yeah, I think he has a... Oh! Ooh. Slams him down. All right. Half guard. Come on. 
He's in full. I'm ready for here. you. Trying to utilize the cage to get back to his feet. Take him back down. Oh, come on. Get down. So resilient. Get the hell down. Trying to drag him down on his back. There we go. And back to full guard. Oh. Try to get some punches in. Bad, yeah, look. It's like they purposely like give them hurt. no help. I've only hit him a few times in the head and he's already on this knocked out. Joe the crowd favorite, the Huntington Beach Bat Boy. Tito Ortiz. Tito Ortiz, huh? Oh, good combination. Trying to punish the midsection. And he answers. Whoa. All right. Fast hands. Good battle inside. Man, this crowd ah. is loving it, Mike. What a fight. Oh, but he oh, ate a left hand. Left oh, shit. He's down. Pushing get up, get up, get up. Away. Got him. Take down. Got a hold of the body, kept driving forward. Boom. Come on. Ground and pound that. And now they're back to their feet. Stuffed. Oh, they're just throwing. Oh, they're Damn right, we're just. Oh, oh shit. He's Again. Down. He's back to his feet, but he's hurt. This guy's tough. Oh, big right yes, he's my down. turn. He oh, he's tagged again. Tag him. Oh. Tag him. Oh, this and one another. is getting ugly. Damn, he's tough. Oh. Oh. And the crowd again cheering for Tito Ortiz. All right, Tito, you're going to. Both guys Damn. staying in tight. Oh, big kick. He's got the Muay Thai clinch. Muay Thai. Boom. Oh, it's over. It is all over. Stop, stop, stop. Fight's over. Fight's wow. Over. Oh, lethal knee. Perfectly executed Muay Thai there. Shogun Hua right there. There you see it again. We'll see that Muay Thai again. And no question about that one. Bam. He is out cold as he drops. Huge victory. It's funny how the referee react like 20 seconds later. You see that knee again from another angle. Pulls yeah. down on the head. Boom. Up with the knee. Knock your lights and out. it's nighty night. Great angle here. There's an up. Oh my God. All teams losing every fight as always. Man, he's still trying to figure out what happened. <laughs> the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffer, has the official That's decision. a vicious knockout. Ladies and gentlemen. I should try a submission. Someone suggested that to me. Instead of trying to knock someone out, I should go for some submissions. I have done a few, some. I think maybe one or two submissions during my career mode. But most of it has just been all knockouts. Knockouts or TKOs. Technical knockouts, as they would call it. Coming up next, a light heavyweight Matt Hamill, huh? Between Matt Hamill and the dangerous Brazilian, Mauricio Shogun Hua. Our Tale of the Day is brought to you by Boost Mobile. Are you ready? Are you ready? It's good how they just go right into the damn uh, match Matt instead Hamill. of going through an announcer with Bruce Buffer. And here we go. This is a lot better. Joe, how do you see this All right, here we go, man. Mauricio Shogun Hua. He's won both his last matchups and comes in here with a lot of momentum. Ooh. Absolutely. And when a guy like this starts to build up confidence, he's very scary. You look for him to come out Whoa. very aggressive tonight. Uh, Hamill keeps getting tagged on that cut. He is bleeding bad, Mike. He is he's down right, he is. Oh, they're just whoa, 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 whoa. Here. Take he him down, take him down. Tight in the clinch. Beautiful. Boom. Great Greco Roman right there, Joe. <laughs> Greco Roman. Joe got the record Greco Roman wrestler. Oh, are you crazy? Man, those are, are you going to give up or what? Punches, Joe. Vicious punches from the top, Mike. Greco Roman, huh? The crowd clearly in favor of Matt Hamill. Why? Because he's deaf? Trying to punish the midsection. Big right hand. Uh. Pushing his All right, here away. we go. Uh. I'm a beast. Oh, nice left and a right. Man, they cheer. Oh, oh he's, he's done. Oh, looking to end this fight. He's in oh, I was going to try to submit him there. Sorry about that, guys. Is over. You should always try to submit someone while they're victory. almost dazed out, almost knocked out. That's the best time to submit Shogun someone. Hua. Shogun's got submission skills as well. 
And that's the beginning of the end. Gets on top of him and swarms on him. And with our official decision, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at two minutes. Shogun. All right, I'm ranked 11 now. All right, here we go, man. Dan Henderson. Between Dan Henderson and the dangerous Brazilian, Mauricio Shogun Hua. Huh? They've got entrances. Our tale of the tape is brought to you by Ed Dan Henderson. How old is he now? He's about 40. How old is he now? 44, 45? It's crazy, and he's still fine at the most elite level. Ladies and gentlemen. This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer. And now, fighting out of the room. Dangerous Dan the Henderson. Begins, Hollywood Dan Henderson. This contest is Eve and now his name is just called Levine, Dan Hendo referee, Henderson. Mike Goldberg along. Are you ready, sir? Are you ready? Mauricio Shogun Hua. Shogun Hua, man. Dan Shogun Hua. They've had two Dan epic battles in the UFC. Underway. The first one was Joe, epic. The second one was Mauricio not so epic, which Shogun happened a few Hua. months ago. He's been pretty successful as of that one. Uh, Shogun was winning two rounds to none. It looked yeah, like Dan Henderson was gassed out. He was finished, attention. and then he, he hit that right hand in the third round. It's ridiculous, man! What a comeback! Oh, nice what a comeback! Right. Oh my! Nice All right. Kick. Some vicious kicks. Vicious kicks. Joe, this building is electric. What a classic match! Oh yeah. That, I love that front kick. That front kick's got so much range. Kick. Push kick. That push and kick. Big one. They call it push kick. It's that front kick. I won't get hit by the right hand, man. Oh, yeah. He's got his back here. Oh, Take him down. A beautiful slam. Some serious power behind that. Oh. And another shot to the body. Oh. And a knee to the body. Man, Those oh, knees, you man. See, the plan is to work the body continuously. Uh, uh. Huge left and right. Those are snapping his head back, Mike. Man, those ribs are gonna be bruised. Yes. In the full mount. Well over two minutes remains in round number one. Break out, man. Anderson is cut, Mike. Now able to posture up. Try to punish the midsection. Punishing those midsections, man. Uh, this and one another. is getting ugly. Shit, I'm gassing here. Here we go! Let's go for that submission. Armbar. Good defense here. He's keeping the hands tight. That is a tight, tight armbar. It's tight, all right. Man, we got it. It is all over. Submission victory by armbar. Mauricio Shogun. Textbook jiu-jitsu. Yeah, you see here, once he's got this, he's got the arm isolated. He arches his back, pulls it, extends the arm for the tap. Here we see it again. Here's where he has the arm bar locked in. Just awesome technique here. Nice arm bar, man. Here's Bruce Buffer with the official decision. There you go, that was a submission for you guys. You should say by winner by armbar, not submission. That's too thingy, man. Not detailed enough. All right, rank seven. Who are we fighting next? Coming up 
up next. All right, Rampage. It is our co-main event of the evening. A light heavyweight showdown between Quentin Rampage Jackson and the dangerous Brazilian. Our tale of the tape is brought to you by the only motorcycles worthy of being in the octagon, Harley Davidson. And now with the official introductions, the veteran voice of the octagon, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the co-main event of the evening. Three round, this man is a Muay Thai kickboxer. And now, fighting! And when the action begins, our referee in charge of this contest Herb Dean. is Herb Dean. Herb Dean is our ref. Are you ready to fight? All right, they've had an epic bout together as well back in Pride. I wish they had another fight back in the UFC when they both were still around. I mean, Shogun's still around, but Rampage has gone to Bellator now. It would have been epic, man. Obviously, Rampage wasn't as good as he was when he was in Pride. He was terrible in Pride. Like, he didn't have the full training camp. Like, a lot of uh, Rampage's problems are usually come by for a lack of motivation. Like, the training is not, like, um, intense enough. He doesn't train hard enough. Oh, nice left and a right. He's John pretty good, though, man. Rampage is pretty good. Even right now, he's still good. Mixing things up nicely. You should start utilizing more leg kicks, though. That's the thing that a lot, like Joe Rogan keeps saying. You guys got to see that battle between them in Pride, though, man. It was awesome. Oh, ducking in and counters that nicely. Oh yeah. Who eyes cut here, Mike? That is a pretty good size cut now on Hua, Mike. You're damn right. He's got his back. Yeah. Big slam. And really raining down some haymakers. Okay. Off of the feet. He lets him up. Oh, whoa. He's got the clinch. Oh. Ooh. Belly to belly again. Half guard. That's a full, full mount, guard. man. Pushing his opponent Damn, he's pushing away. me off quick. He let him up. Well over two minutes remains in round number one. Shit. Oh, They're not getting off tower. He's got his back here. Damn again. And again he goes for a ride. Joe, this place is going wild. Half guard. Joe, let's see what he chooses Damn, he's to trying do to get here. out of the freaking damn bomb position immediately. Look, he's trying to push off immediately. Him off of the feet and he lets him back I should have counted that. I counted that. Push oh. Kick. Come on, push kick again. Yeah, push kick is wicked. Because look, even at range, even when he blocks it, he can't really counter it. If you got if you got it at the right distance like that. There's no way he can counter that. What's he going to counter with even if he blocks it? Obviously he can grab my leg, but if he's blocking it, I'm pretty safe. It's a safe move. Nice right hand. Jesus. Damn right it is. Man, he can't take many more of those. Two. That's going to that's gonna break a rip sooner or later. What? I'm not doing hits with those, man. Doing a lot of damage with those freaking moves. Are you kidding me? He's starting to block the stomach. Nice knee to the body. Oh! He's hurt badly. He's down. Oh. Nice body shot. Oh, very lucky. Nice very lucky. Nice. Our first round is in the books. And the bell came just moments after that huge shot landed. Oh, he's hurt. Look at him. Let's take a look at the replay from that round, Mike. Look at this move. This was an Rah. unbelievable slam. Beautiful technique. And here was that suplex. So much amazing technique in that. There's that knee, man. Ugh. Work off those punches. Remember, defense and offense at the same defense time. Defense and offense, okay. huh? But that off the beautiful... Are you ready to fight? Are you happy be, I'm happy to be using a UFC fighter instead of my damn <laughs> create fighter. They've stance. actually feel more stronger. They've got more Looks like bare moves. Here too, Joe. Ooh. Beautiful hook. All right, okay. Oh, shit. Excellent combination. Oh, God, oh, stop nice hitting me in the head. A left hook and then an uppercut. He's got his back here. Slam him again. Oh, bam. Huge slam. He's in full guard here. Damn. Beautiful. That kick was chipped. Whoa. Check that one. one. Check that. Oh, he's Hell yeah! Again. Both guys staying in tight. Oh, he recovers. Oh my god, I can't take any more hits, man. 
Again, the chance for Rampage Jackson. Jesus. Nice body shot and then hook combination. Oh, wow. oh yeah. Oh, the takedown there. He's done. He's getting jacked. This fight is over. The TKO. Look at my face, though, man. To I took a lot of damage in that fight. Unnecessary Not damage. Mauricio Shogun Hua. Can we see it one more time? Oh, I'm drilling those knees right into the stomach, man. There's no way. There's no way he's gonna get out of that. Game set match. That is a vicious, vicious body shot. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, wow. Rank 5 now. Alright, anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the first part of the title mode. I'll see you guys in the second part where hopefully it will be fine for the title at some point. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace.